Willebrord Snellius was a Dutch astronomer and mathematician, known in the English-speaking world as Snell. In the West, especially the English-speaking countries, his name has been attached to the law of refraction of light for several centuries. But it is now known that this law was first discovered by Ibn Sal in 984. The same law was also investigated by Ptolemy and in the Middle Ages by Whitello, but due to lack of adequate mathematical instruments the results were saved as tables, not functions. The lunar crater Snellius is named after Willebrod Snellius. The Royal Netherlands Navy has named three survey ships after Snellius, including a currently serving vessel, Biography. Willebrord Snellier was born in Leiden, Netherlands. In 1613 he succeeded his father, Rudolf Snell van Royen as professor of mathematics at the University of Leiden. In 1615 he planned and carried into practice a new method of finding the radius of the Earth, by determining the distance of one point on its surface from the parallel of latitude of another, by means of triangulation. His work er Tosthenes Batavis, published in 1617, describes the method and gives us the result of his operations between Alkmaar and Bergen op Zoom, two towns separated by one degree of the meridian, which he measured to be equal to 117,449 yards. The actual distance is approximately 111 kilometers. Snellius was also a distinguished mathematician, producing a new method for calculating pi, the first such improvement since ancient times. He rediscovered the law of refraction in 1621. In addition to the Eratosthenes Batavis, he published Cyclometricus de Circuli Dimensiona, and Tiffys Batavis. He also edited Chile a Sidrum in Eo Errantium Observations a circa, containing the astronomical observations of Landgrave William IV of Hesse. A trigonometry authored by Snellius was published a year after his death. Snellius died at Leiden on October 1626 at the age of 46 from an illness diagnosed as colic.